So I wasn't going to do a top 10 designer list for fragrances for 2020 on spring. I'm actually going to do a top five because these are the five that I'm going to be rocking. And if you guys don't have this in your collection or aren't wearing it, I feel like this is the five we need to be looking at. Let's go. Hey, what's up, LSF fam? Welcome to Lee Style. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, I'm all right, guys. I'm all right. Don't worry about it. I talk about men's style, fragrance, grooming, some vlogs here and there. And I throw a dash of confidence at you. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification, too. Let's hang out. Come on. All right, so I'm not gonna waste any time. Number five spot, we have Vintage Green. I actually haven't worn this in a while and I revisited it and I was like, man, this is an amazing fragrance. Nice tea note, super green, super fresh. Absolutely love this fragrance. And it's super cheap too. I think it's the cheapest on this list. So number five spot, we have Banana Republic Vintage Green. Full review on this too, I'm gonna drop it down below so you guys can check it out. Number four spot, we have Dior Ohm. And this is the OG. This is what a lot of people copy the DNA from. This is where Prada Lone copied his DNA from. Now, Prada Lone is a little bit more smoother than this. This is a lot of iris, but this is an absolutely amazing fragrance. Absolutely amazing compliment getter. This is definitely one of my favorite irises out there period absolutely love this fragrance this is dior own number four spot coming in at the number three spot it is a very hype fragrance we're talking about lone adiel cologne by girl lane this is one of my absolute absolute favorite fragrances ever like this right here i would argue that this to me is niche level like i feel like when it comes to other things, like you can smell synthetics on here, but I feel like this smells as good as a niche fragrance, in my opinion. I feel like this is one of the best designer fragrances out there. And yes, it's discontinued now, but you can get it on discounted sites. This is also another great cheapie right here, and I feel like everybody should have this in their closet. Absolutely amazing when it comes to compliments too. Decent performer. IDL Lone Cologne by Guerlain, number three spot. Coming in at the number two spot. So when I first got into fragrances, I used to really like this citrus note. Like I was really into citruses. And this fragrance remind me of why I really love fragrances and why I even came to this collection and reviewing game. It is for fragrances like this. This really took me back. But we're talking about Artisan Pure by John Barbatos. This is an absolute amazing fragrance. Like, talk about creamy, just juicy citrus. Like, I absolutely, absolutely love this fragrance. I could not wait to wear this. I bought this a few months back, and I was just like, oh my gosh, I can't wait to get warm out, and I can wear wear this fragrance. This is amazing. John Barbatos, Artisan Pure, number two spot. They can only be one number one. What would it be? None other than Terre D Hermes. This right here is a classic. This right here is definitely to me, this smells like a niche fragrance. It performs very well. You have some pepper in there. You have some orange, citrus. Like this is just divine. Like this is like, if you want attention, if you want a sexy masculine fragrance this is definitely at the top of my list when it comes to all five of these and this is my number one fragrance for designer that i'm going to be rocking spring 2020 let's get it guys let me know what's your top five designer list for 2020 that you're going to be rocking let me know which ones you've tried out let me know which ones you haven't i'm curious to see what you guys are going to say so let me know down below in the comments let's go don't forget the smell stylish don't forget to follow me if you guys aren't following me already instagram twitter don't forget to like comment share and of course subscribe short dark and handsome gang lsf fam love you guys see you next time peace